you're trying to do with uh, a bit of music like this is when you hear that music you want to immediately associate it with famous grouse and I think it does and, and that's come because it's quite a catchy tune anyway. We'll do things where you might think that a piece of music is a constant pace but we'll actually be making it slightly faster and slightly slower and maybe having a 2-4 bar and a 3-4 bar but the overall effect is it just goes dum 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 you know and it will it will just seem like it, it it's effortless we were very aware when we did it that this was going to be a track that potentially could run and run um, and the great thing about this melody it is very versatile very flexible i mean over the years we've done jazz versions, we've done orchestral versions. We did one um, which was Mendelssohn's Fingal's Cave where we got the LSO in and it starts off with all Mendelssohn uh, and then it just morphed into the famous grass tune. Me and Julian were very much working as a partnership. I put the demos together for that and then when we were, at, when we were recording at Abbey Road we needed both of us on hand because Julian was in charge of dealing with all the music and the scores and everything and I was in charge of making sure that everything was recorded properly and that it was all sounding right and that the takes were working with the pictures so the two of us were flying around in between the studio and in between the desk. I mean there's a lot of scope to experiment and um and have a lot of fun with it and it is, it's very flexible. I mean, I don't think there's probably a style of music we couldn't do that tune to. 